Hey everyone, someone reminded me that I haven't made a video in a while, and I haven't done a food haul in a while, so that's what we're here for today. I was back from the gym, exhausted, but I'll give you a quick update. Um, my weight, pretty constant, 180 plus or minus one pound. Um, I've been weighing way too frequently, just to make sure that I don't dip too low or shoot up or whatever, but it seems to be pretty constant. Um, calories, 3,600, 3,800, somewhere in that range. Um, I kind of gave up on the trying to keep my sugars real, real low because it was too hard to get the calories in. So it's been a few weeks that I've just been kind of letting it get the sugar back in, and it seems to be doing okay. So not going to complain, right? Um, can't tell what I'm getting fat anyway, so whatever, <laughs> right? Um, everything else. Oh, yeah. See the demon eyes? <laughs> yeah, that's what I got for Christmas. I got an eye infection. So I've been fighting that. And that, you know, you think it's your eyes. It wouldn't really affect your your body very much. But with my immune system all screwed up and on prednisone, the eye infection is just knocking me right out. So my workouts have been crappy. Strength bad, energy bad, enthusiasm bad. Everything's bad. And uh, yeah. All broken out here, there, everywhere from the prednisone because it's been been on prednisone now for two and a half months. Yay me! <laughs> so, but, but other than that, everything seems to be going okay. Um, livers normalish. Um, had a bunch of scan, a bone scan. Let's have an ultrasound. And I see my doctor at the end of February. So we'll see how everything is going. So yeah, that's it. And uh, let's go for the grocery haul. Things have been pretty 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 sparse here because I've been uh, I've been saving up to get my car repaired. So um, yeah, like a nine hundred dollar repair, which is like a lot. So hopefully if I don't spend too much this month, I can get it done. If not, it'll be next month that I'll get my car fixed. <laughs> But anyway, let's look at the haul. So, I didn't get very much because I never get very much. I have my nice little, over here, here, here. That's my recycling box. That's didn't buy that. Um, so, up top, I get these baked chip things. You know, I actually like the taste of them. I find the regular chips are kind of greasy. So, I buy these and I hardly ever eat them. <laughs> I actually have two boxes over there already. Um, but yeah, I, they were on sale. And I got some snap peas. I like those. Um, black pea or black beans. Uh, I use that for my black bean brownies. Chili, which is one thing that I've been eating currently. Um, I got some whole wheat, whole grain bread. I got these cashew crackers. I really like these. These are pretty, pretty healthy-ish. I think it's like 80 calories. Yeah, 80 calories for 10 crackers, which is, you know, pretty much what I use. And they're all like whole grain stuff. I got lettuce because my stomach doesn't get full enough. <laughs> That's a lie. I don't know. I just like the crunch of lettuce in my sandwiches and stuff. I got a big bag of uh, Cortland apples. I had to get some condiments. So I got some Miracle Whip and some hot Dijon mustard. I've got my uh, poverty tomato and my poverty <laughs> lemon, uh, just for two little things I'll be cooking this week. I've been eating these pure protein bars. Uh, you know, they're not the best stat-wise because they don't have any fiber in them, but they're like a third of the price of a Quest bar. So when I'm poor, you know, and I just want that little, a little protein snack at night, well, that's what I do. I got some uh, soap. <laughs> Because my hands are not already dry enough. So I got the extra cheap, crappy soap. So to dry out my hands even more. Because I wash them so, so much. Um, this is actually my favorite frozen dinner. This is one of those steamer things. This is the ravioli and chicken florentine. Which in itself is kind of good. Because I'm, I'm not going to eat ravioli any at a time, right? But look at the stats on this. It's like 260 calories, 20 grams of protein. So, um... Yeah, it's 500 grams of 500 milligrams of salt, but whatever. 
It's got a lot of protein because it's got that ravioli in there, and the ravioli's got cheese, and then it's got chicken on top of that. So it's like pretty good deal. Pretty good deal. This is my uh, yogurt that I've been eating, 2% plain. Mix that with some frozen berries and some trivia. Uh, of course, I got some cottage cheese down there. This is the remnants of my uh, protein bars from my big massive haul. Still holding out. Still got quite a few. Still got quite a few. And I picked up, I had these, found these on clearance a couple weeks ago. These bounce bars. Oh my god, I love them so much. They're like so small. Like, they're really small. But I think this one is like 10 to 13 grams of protein, depending on which one you get. So, good deal. Good deal. Uh, what else do we have of interest here? Let's look at my little pantry shelves. Water, onion, coffee. Down the bottom, we got some pita crisps. Uh, we've got fiber one cereal, popcorn, jerky, pancakes. Um, oops. <laughs> beep, beep. Sorry, I pressed the button on my phone. Hopefully, it's still recording. This is another thing I got in my little uh, gift box. These are actually pretty tasty. They're like very cinnamony. I like them. Of course, we got the trivia. We got some tuna down there. This is actually not trivia. It's uh, the other one, Splenda. Bananas. More protein bars. <laughs> yeah, this is Crystal White. It went on clearance. It was like a dollar each, so I got them all. <laughs> Uh, this also went on clearance. We had a store here in Canada, Loblaws, that was going out of business. So everything was like 50% or 75% off. So I got some Tassimo coffee. because I don't usually get that because it's kind of pricey. But it's a nice chance to get some espresso and some uh, uh, cappuccino type stuff. This is what I've been taking to the gym with me. This BCA Amino Core. It really helps with my... Um, I find I don't get the muscle soreness after I work out if I take this during my workout. So there's a tip for anyone who has muscle soreness. Um, more drink mixes. And a whole lot of protein. Oh yeah, tahini. Tahini's a must if you're going to be making uh, your own hummus. And you should make your own hummus because it's pretty easy, right? So can of chickpeas, like four tablespoons of tahini, uh, one lemon two garlic, bunch of sriracha sauce, boom, you got kick-ass, kick-ass hummus, and a lot of it too. Um, little coffee things, protein, 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 there's some creatine back there, more protein, more protein, more protein, more protein. That's it. <laughs> you wanna look at my fridge? That could be interesting. Yeah, pretty Spartan, I got eggs. I got eggs, I got some chicken and, and a sweet potato, I got a thing of bacon in the bottom, I got some uh, flax meal, I got some milk, pickles, and yeah, that's about it. <laughs> it's pretty empty. Freezer is packed right full. I got the peas, I've got... Um, Assorted bagels and English muffins for my breakfast. I've got these frozen juice that have been there for about three years and uh, probably should throw them out because <laughs> I'm never going to drink them. Um, I got a frozen pizza. I actually got a frozen pie, like a crumbly apple pie. I've got lots of frozen fruits for my shakes and smoothies in the morning. And I've got all kinds of uh, portioned out chili. Each one of those is like one portion, 250 grams. Got some salmon. A whole bunch of ice cream is laying in the back. Again, ice cream is one of those things that I get. I tend, my mother tends to gift it to me for some reason. I don't really know why. I think she thinks I'm too skinny. Um, <laughs> but yeah, it just sits in the freezer and I have it like once in a while. I like to actually put it on brownies. So it's like a double. It's a double bad bad boy thing, right? The brownies and ice cream on the brownies. So so that's it, guys. It's super boring like it always is, but I hope everyone is having fun, getting out there, getting your fitness in. I see there's like lots of challenges and stuff going on, which is good. But remember, when you're doing these challenges, don't just do it for 30 days. Because that's what they always do it for. 
concentrate on making those habits, healthy habits that are going to carry you not just for 30 days and lose weight, but for the rest of your life, right? All right, guys, get up there, be strong, flex shot. I have no energy to even flex. That's how bad it is. It's real bad. All right, guys, bye.